Hello and welcome to another video. In this one we're going to be talking about a little bit of a pro tip when working with get and commit messages. Uh, so without further ado, let's jump into it. Okay, so I learned this recently. I'm going to show you the ways that I used to use get commit dash m uh, and other ways to make commit messages. And then I'm going to show you the cool new way that I learned. Anyway, we're going to start by initializing a git repository uh, repo and we'll cd into that. And uh, the way that I have made commit messages before, uh, there are kind of two ways that I would do commit messages. So uh, we're going to be using allow empty because I don't actually want to add any comment contents to this repo. Uh, but the two ways that I would make commits before was either by doing dash m some commit message, and you know that that works great. That causes the commit message to be you know some commit message, and that's what dash m does for you. And sometimes I would want to add more contents to the body of the commit. And so what I would do is leave out dash M and this will open up your text editor. So you can see like it opens up my text editor Babby here and you can put, you know, your commit message here, more information here. And so you can kind of fill out the body of your commit message like that. And if you save and exit that, you'll see that you get, you know, your commit message here and more information here. But I learned about this really, really cool tip in that if you specify the dash M flag more than once, it will fill in the body of your commit for you. So I can do git commit allow empty, you know, uh, first line here. And then I can specify dash M again, body message here. And that will do the same thing as opening up the text editor, but now I don't have to open my text editor, which is really cool. Um, but anyway, that's that's the total of the tip. That's that's it. <laughs> that's that's the quick little tip. I actually wonder what happens if you do more things here. Uh, cool. Okay, so it just like gives you more more bodies after that. That's pretty cool. Uh, but anyway, hopefully this was useful. If you guys have additional stuff you want me to explain, leave a comment below or reach out to me on the various platforms. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.